Hello YouTube, so I've finally decided to continue the, um, well, finish off the Mega Minx series I had made a while ago, about, well, I had started a while ago, about how to solve a Mega Minx, um, using Bolin's method. So, now I'm at the advanced stage, so the first part of the last layer for uh, advanced, more advanced last layer, is the edge orientation. Now, there isn't all that much special stuff you can do to edge orientation um, to improve your solves, but there are a few things. So the first thing is when you have the three adjacent ones uh, for edge orientation, so that you can avoid having cases that have five edges misoriented, because those are very annoying, um, what you can do is, I showed you three algs in the other video, so this is what they are, so there's this alg, which is this, like that, and then there's this alg, which goes like this, and then finally there was this alg, which goes like this. So if you know how to do these three, then you're able to to get a case with four or more corners oriented every time when you get an edge orientation case with three edges oriented. So how you do that is you look at this corner. So if the corner here has the right color on the top, then you're going to do this alk. So alk number one. Uh, I'll put them in the description. So, yeah, if it's on the top, you do that one. If this corner is facing you, then you, you're going to do the alg number two. And these three uh, algs are algs you should already know from 3x3. Three three. There are three uh, very standard OLLs. And then finally, if it's not on the top or facing you, so if it's on the right, then you're going to do the third alg. So if you're able to do that, then you're guaranteed to get an ALG, uh, an, a corner OLL, so OCLL, that has four, uh, f you'll never get a, f a case with five corners or five corners misoriented. Um, now for the other case, for when you have the line like this, there isn't all that much you can do, I don't know any special really any things for that one that are similar to the ones I just showed you. However, um, there are often oil algs that resemble very much the ones on 3x3. So, for example, this one very much resembles this oil on 3x3, which goes like that, and, oops, and can be used on here to solve the OLL. Uh, another example of that is this OLL, so it resembles very much oops, this OLL on 3x3 three three. and you can apply it to Megaminx. So, whenever you have an alg that looks similar uh, to one on 3x3 three three on the Mega Minx, often it works, however, beware, it doesn't always work. So, you'll have to fiddle around with them to make sure that they work before you actually use them. So, that's pretty much it for this tutorial. There's not nothing super advanced you can do on this, this sub-step. So, that's it for the video. Thanks.